Meanwhile, the White House is renewing calls for Congress to act on gun control in the wake of the deadly school shooting in Tennessee. Caroline Shively has more from Washington. After a shooter killed three children and three adults with AR-style weapons at a school in Nashville Monday, America has questions for Washington. How is this still happening? How are our children still dying and why are we failing them? President Biden says it's time for lawmakers to act. If I call on Congress again to pass my assault weapons ban, it's about time that we begin to make some more progress. According to the Gun Violence Archive, there have been 129 mass shootings in 2023, 37 of them in March. 13 have been at schools, like this one in Denver last Wednesday. That's an average of one school shooting every week in America. Not one child needs to die. We must pass meaningful gun safety legislation and need to look at every possible way to do so. But many congressional Republicans point to the Second Amendment and say law-abiding gun owners shouldn't face restrictions. I really get angry when I see people trying to politicize it for their own personal agenda, especially when we don't even know the facts. The 1994 assault weapons ban lapsed in 2004. As of now, it appears supporters don't have the 216 votes needed in the House to renew it. In Washington, Caroline Shively, Fox News.